I don't know how you imagine heaven to be. This is heaven to me, my friends. In this video, I'm going to Jakarta, Indonesia, and I'll visit their state-of-the-art internet cafe. If you guys don't know what an internet cafe is, it's a place full of gaming PCs where you can pay to play video games with your friends. I made a video about a Korean internet cafe a while back, and when I learned that Indonesia has them too, I couldn't help but explore the place myself. So come with me to the outskirts of Jakarta, let's go try this internet cafe. It's kind of hard to believe that there's an internet cafe around here. In fact, I've come to where Google Maps says it is. Um, I can't seem to find it. The internet cafe was in the somewhat less developed side of Jakarta. I had a hard time finding it, so I ended up asking people for directions. Okay, okay. Thank you. All right, thank you. Guys, I found it. This is the Indonesian internet cafe. Oh my god, they actually have it. It's such an epic space. Oh, this is just like Korea. They have an internet cafe here too. Wow, this is so cool. When I asked the workers if it's okay to film videos for YouTube, they started taking me on a tour before I could finish the sentence. So the internet cafe here was actually a lot larger than I thought. In fact, they took up the entire building. They charge different rates for different rooms, some nicer than the others. So let's go have a tour right now. So on the first floor, they had diamond rooms costing 5,000 rupiah or 32 cents an hour. And these were one of the more affordable rooms. But of course they have something better. There's a VIP room. Apparently they have a VIP room for the people who can spend a little more. So their VIP room has faster PCs for gaming and better air conditioning. There's one kid playing Valorant. He's so focused. Like I was saying earlier, this internet cafe is quite large and they have more rooms on the second floor too. You guys are not going to believe it, but they have a room just for live streaming. Unfortunately, they didn't have a female hot top streamer, but they had this Indonesian gentleman. Say whatever you want, but to me, he's just as charming as Belle Delphine. This internet cafe is really like a small world because there's a place for the top one percenters as well. Check out this VVIP room that comes with a bed. Is, is it okay? Thank you, thank you. I don't know this gentleman's name, but he must be like the Indonesian wolf of Wall Street. Do you live here? <laughs> He's, you're taking a break? Yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah, gaming is hard. It's far from luxurious, but I can't deny that it looks cozy as hell. Okay, that's where the rich people play, but what about the everyday people? Well, the everyday people play right here in the gold room. At only 3,000 rupiah or 19 cents an hour, this is their most affordable option, and therefore the users are mostly children. Let's try to talk to them for no reason. Oh, I know that lady too. Hello. <laughs> you like YouTube? You like YouTube? You like YouTube? You should watch me. Here, here. Search. Search. I could use a few more subscribers. Let's do some self promo. They'd be so freaked out. Oh, look at me. <laughs> The kids went absolutely nuts, it was adorable. Do you like Roblox? Yeah. Oh, I love Roblox too. You know, 5,000 years ago, I was a kid too. Yes, yes. <laughs> How often do you guys come here? Do you guys come here every day? No. No? no, no. How many days a week? Uh, one. One day? Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> one day? Yeah. Oh. No computer at home? No, no. No computer? Ah, oh, that's so sad. Most of these children can't afford to have a PC at home, let alone a smartphone. So this is the only place for them to have access to the internet and play video games. Hello. There's a gentleman watching anime too. They also took me to their office, which is on the third floor. You guys have an office? You guys have a gym? Yeah. <laughs> So on the third floor, they have their office. I'm guessing that this is where serious business happens. I don't know who drew these, but these are some nice drawings. I'm glad to see that this is a work environment that appreciates art and creativity. This is a very nice internet cafe. It's very cool. Oh, by the way, did you guys know that with over 87% of its people being Muslim, Indonesia has the largest Islamic population in the world? That's exactly why this internet cafe has a prayer room. You play hard, you gotta pray hard too, you know? This is like the coolest thing ever. 
Oh, do you guys sell food here too? Yeah, food. Food, wow. Wow, really? Oh, this is the menu? Yeah. Hell, this is so cool. I'm gonna get some later. Thai tea sounds good too. Okay, I think that's enough tour for now. I feel like I have to play some games myself. Indonesia has their Pishibang Hyung too. <laughs> I want to play in the diamond room. Do I pay now or when I leave? Uh, pay now. 6,000? 6,000? Yes. How you Can I sit here? My chair is barely held together. But that's okay. So once you sit down, your prepaid time will show up on screen. And this is like the most nerve-wracking countdown for gamers. So they have different specs for each of the rooms. As you guys can see, this is pretty shiny, right? This is a diamond room. I bet the specs are very impressive. I'm very geeky, so I had to check out their computer specs. Oh, it's a GTX 1050 Ti. I'm kind of shocked that they still have one running. Yeah. They have an i3 CPU. And c oh, 16 gig RAM, that's not bad at all. I noticed that the guy next to me was playing Valorant, which is a game that I play too. So I decided to talk to him for no reason. My friend, what rank are you? Huh? What rank? Uh, uh I'm just silver. Silver? Uh, okay. Internet cafe is where a lot of friendships are born. So I asked him if I can play some games with him and he said yes. Thank God, I don't deal with rejections very well. I'm gonna play with my new friend here. What is uh, your name? Uh, just call me Padil. Padil? <laughs> okay, yeah. okay, Padil. <laughs> and you guys know what real friends do? Real friends play video games together. Bro, you want some you want some lemon tea? I'll get you some lemon tea. Oh uh, no, thanks. I'm, I'm, I'm okay. I'm Are you fine. sure? Yeah. Okay. How often do you come here? Once a week. Once a week? Yeah. Oh, that's not yeah, enough, I'm man. <laughs> These people in your team, are they your friends in real life? Yeah. Yeah? Friends in real life? Yeah. Not Discord friends? <laughs> Trust me, okay? Uh, yeah. We got I got this. Okay. I believe you. I'm Korean. I, I know how to play video games. Yeah. <laughs> I don't play as much video games as I used to, but playing some video games in the same room as your friends, it's the kind of fun that is just timeless, you know? I gotta say, I wasn't playing too well this day, so I had to come up with a typical gamer boy excuse. The mouse yeah. jitters a lot. Uh, uh, even, like yeah. on the mousepad. My friend here was so selfless that he switched this mousepad with mine like that was going to improve my gaming skills. But this is kind of like gamer feng shui, you know? You don't really believe it, but you do it anyway. Why do you come to Internet Cafe? Oh, because I don't have this PC. Oh, you don't have PC at yeah. all? Oh. You have it? Well, I have one, yeah. Oh, it's good. Yeah, it's nice oh. to have one. Ah, one day you work and yeah. buy one. I hope that's a... I know this is a weird question, but hmm? do you have like, do you have a lot of friends on Discord? No, just, just, just them. Just these friends? Yeah. Oh man, you gotta have a Discord girlfriend, man. <laughs> uh, I'm never in a relationship. Bro. You've never been in a relationship? Stop playing video games. Yeah, Go get okay. a girlfriend. It's okay. It's okay. I've only had Discord girlfriends too. <laughs> she found another guy whose profile picture was a cooler anime character. We lost the game at the end, but I made a new friend and we had a lot of fun together. So I felt like I really won in life. Well, he looks very disappointed, but I'm sure he'll forgive me. Next time I come back to Indonesia, I'll do better. Okay? What time are you gonna go home? Seven or eight? Oh, bro. You don't have to study, just play a bunch of video games. All right, thanks, man. Yeah. It was good meeting you. A very good boy. After the game, I saw this gentleman eating this amazing food, so I felt like I need to get some food as well. Dude, your food looks fantastic. What is this? Telur crispy, bro. Cl cl Telur crispy. Telur crispy? Yes. Telur crispy? Now, seeing that made me really hungry, so I'm gonna get myself some nasi goreng. Thank you. Unlike Korea, they didn't have cute Korean girls working in the kitchen, but there was this one gentleman who was taking care of the entire kitchen by himself like a champion. And it looks like he's cooking some fried chicken. Can't wait to see what my nasi goreng is going to taste like. What the hell? I found a cat in the kitchen. Oh, how much for the cat? I have three cats. Three cats? <laughs> Um, but Jimmy, that's so unhygienic and in my country, that's unthinkable. 
I see what you're saying, but I mean, not all countries have spotless infrastructure. So either you get a cat walking around in the kitchen, or swarms of rats. And I'd much rather take the cat. The cat's probably gluten-free and low sugar if that makes you feel any better. Oh, you're getting too close to me. No, that's my no-no square. Ow. <laughs> Sing for me. <laughs> Who's this guy? There's another one. The cats here were like Indonesian people. Super chill and harmless, and they love to get close to me. Oh wow, thank you. And here I finally got my food. Let's take a seat and taste it. After a painful loss, anybody could use some nasi goreng. Man, that's some real food that I could appreciate. Similar to Korea, I love how they have real food in an internet cafe. Nasi goreng is an Indonesian fried rice dish. And you see this just about everywhere you go in Indonesia. At only about $1.50, it was extremely affordable. And while it might not be the most delicious nasi goreng you can find in Indonesia, it's a good, satisfying meal within your reach while you're enjoying some video games. Overall, I thought the internet cafe experience here was extremely fun, definitely not fancy, but it delivers the core experience of being in an internet cafe. That is, playing video games, making friends, and just having a blast in a comfortable environment. The internet cafe that they had here was like what internet cafe used to be for me. Kind of dark and chaotic, but it's like super fun, you know what I mean? Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll be back with another video like this. Take care. Well, if you guys want more videos like this, you guys can listen to my songs on Spotify for free, but Spotify will pay me, and I'll spend that money on creating more content like this. Thank you.